Okay, so let's talk about briefly uh, tuning your guitar, okay? So, this is what you call a clip-on tuner. But, um, the thing is, like, you can use your smartphone and download a tuner app, alright? And then what you can do is, uh, that, that tuner app will use your, um, your built-in mic to sense the string, alright? Or, uh, there's a tuner app where it'll just play the pitch and you have to kind of tune it by ear. But, um, I would, I would, if your ear's not good at listening, I would probably, uh, just use the, the tuner that detects your pitch, okay? So, as we know, alright, the first string is the bottom string right here, right? First string. So that's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Let's so first start with tuning the first string, okay? So the first string is a E. So when you, when you play the note, and for example, I'm using my clip-on tuner, you should see the, the letter E, the note E come out, alright? Now it's not in tune, because you see that uh, it's not centered. So what I have to do is, right now it's flat, alright? So I have to tune it up slowly, alright? So I get to right in the middle. Right here. Alright? Now judging by whatever app you have on the cell phone, alright, could just be a needle, or it could be like kinda like what I have, like a little bar uh, thing going on. But uh, yeah, it has to be in the middle, okay? So that makes it tune. Okay? Now sometimes um, you might have something like this. That means it's too sharp. It, you went over too much. So that means that you have to lower the pitch. So you have to turn the knob the other way lower it and get down to the right in tune, okay? Alright, let's go to the next string, the B string. The B string, slightly sharp, right? It's a little bit over. So, let's get that to the center. Right? So it's going to be important to know what the notes are uh, on the string. So the first string note is E, B, G, alright? So first string again is E, second string B, third string G, alright, then fourth string D, fifth string A, and then sixth string E. So those are the open notes, alright, and that's what you have to tune it to. So the second string is B, so have to make sure we have the B note, alright. Now the thing is, if you have, say, if it's really out of tune, right, it might say A, so you know that you're way below, so you gotta tune the thing up to B, right? And you wanna tune it right to pitch, right? It might take some practice, but you gotta tune it to B, okay? All right, let's go to the third string, G. It's a little flat, right? It's below. So we gotta tune it up. Check the other strings. How about the, the D string? D string, it's in tune. How about A string? That's in tune. And E string, it's a little flat. So, you tune it up a little bit. And there you go. It's in tune. So, what you really should do is check your tuning every day and practice tuning your guitar every day, and eventually it'll just become second nature. But the important thing is, like, remember the string name. So it's going to be E, B, G, D, A, E. Or sometimes I like to use a phrase like, uh, Every boy gets dessert after Easter. Uh, one my friend made up is, Easter bunny gets drunk after Easter. Of course, I wouldn't use that for, you know, children. But, you know, since if you're an adult, you know, you probably you know, get a laugh at that one. But... Easter bunny gets drunk after Easter. So you use the phrase whatever you know will remind you of the the note.